past few years, I think there has been definitely greater interest in issues of sustainability among businesses in Singapore, particularly after the release of the Singapore Green Plan. So even at SPF, over the past years, we've been working with quite a number of uh, companies and trade associations and chambers, including Eurochamp and uh, several of Eurochamp's members, to better understand what does sustainability mean for businesses. And we have just published our policy paper uh, to talk about sustainability in business as well as sustainability as business. So what we hope to see from uh, our engagement is that uh, we can strengthen the whole sustainability ecosystem in Singapore and help Singapore companies to explore growth opportunities in the area of sustainability. I think Singapore definitely has had a good start and made good progress, uh, both actually both before and after the release of the Green Plan. So in our conversation with the different companies, both big and the small and medium enterprises, we do get feedback that uh, there is much greater awareness. And in fact, many of the larger enterprises already have good sustainability plans and are doing a lot more on their sustainability journey. As for the small and medium enterprises, we do see that there's greater awareness, uh, but there are also questions that remain as to what is it that they need to do and what is it that they can do to tap on sustainability. And so particularly for SMEs, we see a lot of scope for the business community to come together and work together to enable SMEs to also tap on sustainability as growth opportunities. And there's definitely a role for trade association and chambers like SBF, like Eurochamp to play in bringing together big companies, SMEs to work together to look at the opportunities that are out there. So uh, when we look at it, especially when we talk to SMEs, we try and tell them that they can look at it as two parts. First is sustainability in business. How can they make their business more sustainable to better cater to the needs of their customers uh, and the needs of their investors? At the same time, they can also look beyond that to look at sustainability as a business. What are the opportunities out there? And that if they have good sustainability practices, good sustainability solution, it is also something that they can export and they can sell beyond Singapore and use it to grow their business.